decide or what types of things should I consider when choosing what's most appropriate for my brokerage? Well, when you have your, when you're starting your own brokerage, you really want to focus on your strengths. So if you're someone who was an ex salesperson that worked at a, maybe an introducing broker for a more established broker and you have a history of clients that have been trading on MT4, well, then it's absolutely, uh, absolutely necessary for you to get that, uh, that MT4 platform because you'll be able to convert those clients easier. But if, say, you are a, a company and you are raised and maybe you raised a few million dollars to start a brokerage um, as an investment and you wanted to build like your own mousetrap, so to speak, your own Robin Hood, your own trading two and two, your own eToro, then what you're going to want to do is you're either going to want to get a development team and build your own platform so you can have a unique experience, or you're going to want to work with someone like FDC and the Condor platform and use our platform framework as the base. And then over time, as you like it, you develop it more into your own unique offering with your own logos, own colors, own designs, even own customized applications for iOS and everything like that. So it's all about customization, customization, providing your own unique value, really. Yeah, yeah, it's about customization and also for the owners to do what's their strength. So if you have no experience and even like knowing what you want, if you don't have no vision for what you want of your platform, if you just want to be a reseller, then you should do that. But if you want to, uh, you know, if you want like if you want to have a business that you'll be able to sell for more than a percentage of the client deposits, but to actually get a uh, price to earnings multiple by having your own technology and being able to acquire, uh, you know, other companies and consolidate into a bigger firm, then you'll need something of your own software. But what I found is that most companies will actually do a hybrid solution where they'll have a, a master back office system uh, using one of the fantastic CRMs like Scale, for example. And then what they do is they, they take in the MetaTrader for the guys who want MetaTrader. They take in the C-Trader for the guys that want C-Trader. They take in the standard Condor platform for the guys that want Condor. And for the guys that want their own unique uh, unique front ends, unique apps, unique systems, whether it's a robo trading platform or, or anything, they work with someone like us. And then through Scale, we can integrate it all with the the broker's uh, offering stack. Well, I didn't realize. So that's kind of really gives them the ability to create something unique for the for the brokers. It's just not just an off-the-shelf uh, type of platform. A thousand percent. So, uh, you know, uh, yeah. So we we provide the absolute complete source code. So uh, if, if a company wants. So that's one thing that hugely differentiates us from, from uh, say, MetaTrader. If you look at it like this, MetaTrader will charge, uh, like, I believe initially they were charging $100,000, $150,000 you know, the primary of that, you know, is up front. So, you know, with us, if you're going to make that sort of payment anyway, you're, you're just better off getting a copy of the source code. And then right. you can show your investors, this is yours, this is mine. Right. And then we, we do development work for our clients' behalf. So we can dedicate, we have a, a team and, and we have a team of developers building the Forex platforms. We'll assign anywhere from two to five dedicated programmers to, to a brokerage. And then we'll basically take the copy of our source code, create a new fork in the road uh, for just their branch. And then we just build for them as long as they want for whatever they need. And that's fully incorporated into their business. Brilliant. By the way, I have a client either. I didn't realize that you were there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, perfect. Well, that's that's why I'm talking. Somebody you should speak to. <laughs> that, that we don't need to win the video, but yeah. Okay, very yeah. good.